Williamson in there on the handle right now for Wake and the handoff. Musius spin cycle to the rim and score the basket. Isaiah Musius going to the free throw line. But he's the guy they'll look to in the post with, especially with Huff out of the game. So Hauser's got five points at the other end. Whoa, he wants home court advantage. He wants to play that tournament right here at John Paul Jones Arena. And here comes Clark. He's got Murphy. And that one knocked away. Good pursuit that time defensively. Jalen Johnson got back. Musius to the rim. Gets the roll. And it's like mirror images of one another without that uh, real post presence inside. Another wow. three. Is that Masood again, Mike? 100 people are maximum capacity for fans tonight under the health and safety guidelines and protocols of UVA and the ACC. Here's a steal. It'll be Beekman going in. Two-fisted rim rocker. Hauser trying to back in. Drew the double, found the open man. Dropped it off to Justin McCoy for two. Knowing the style that he played, but, uh, you know, a little bit slow, very deliberate, solid defense. But uh, you win like that, and your fans will come out. Beekman makes a steal. Hauser trying to fill the lane. Tries to get around defender and score the basket in the foul against Wake. Well, they were number one seed and declared the champs. Number two seed was Virginia as Clark hits a little fall away action. He's got a three tonight, made three threes against Notre Dame, and Clark will glide in. Timeout, Steve Forbes and Wake Forest. Clark, what a pass. Threaded the needle right to McCoy. And all of those 10 have been in the paint for Clark. After that pretty assist to McCoy, that's a tough twisting shot. Musius, more sense of urgency. Antonio lost the handle, and Wake's going to lose the game. So they made a run late, but 70 61 is going to be our final count, Mike. And Tony Bennett and the Virginia Cavaliers have won five of their last six, and they're now six and two.